My name's Emma Johnston. I'm a professor at the University of New South Wales and director of the Sydney Harbour Research Program for the Sydney Institute of Marine Science. The harbour is my laboratory, although I've worked from the Great Barrier Reef all the way down to Antarctica. And all of the work that I do is underneath the water, so it's all subtitle research. Sydney Harbour is an incredibly diverse harbour. It's biologically diverse, but it's also environmentally diverse. We have a huge range of environmental conditions here, and it's really, really special. So despite having four million people living here and a history of industrialisation, which has really left its mark, we're very fortunate to still have a great deal of different habitats and species that are associated with those habitats. Being underwater is just amazing. It's another world. I can't imagine a place that is, is more different. The first time that anyone goes scuba diving and that you can just stay underwater and you can breathe under there is one of the most inspiring moments of your life. It's a great honour to be the inaugural winner of the Nancy Millis Award from the Australian Academy of Science. It's so important to have females being recognised for their achievements in marine science, but being put up there as role models for the next generation of scientists. If a young girl came to me and said, I'm thinking about a career in science, I would say, go for it. It's, it's so rewarding, it's so much fun. You will never, ever get bored.